In this routine, we're going to focus on four supersets. Superset concept is hitting the same group muscle over and over and over to be able to work on strength, endurance, cardiovascular, and balance. And that's what's going to happen here. I'm going to give you a recipe that can be applied to a push, to a split squat, lunge, any kind of movement can benefit from this recipe. The first exercise is going to be 30 seconds and we're going to be on one light on the power plate. So your default setting for 30 seconds and we're going to do four times 30 seconds. Let's start with the example of a squat. We're going to be standing on the power plate, feet wide open, soften your knee, push on the ball of your foot and we're going to stay there with the eyes closed for 30 seconds. Why? because we're going to want to wake up your central nervous system and your reflex arc and really get that communication between the brain, the central nervous system and the muscle sharp and active. All right, let's do that together. So I have 30 seconds on my timer. I'm going to start my vibration now. Hold here the position where you are really not feeling much vibration to the head and we're going to stay there for 30 seconds. Close your eyes. Try to really feel the effort you're making to stay in that position for the 30 second. You don't have to worry about the vibration. It will stop at the end of those 30 seconds. Push on the ball of your feet, soften your knee, close your eyes, absorb the vibration through your core and every muscle under tension. All right, we're arriving at the end of those 30 seconds for me and relax. Good. Now the second set is going to be called a static variable. We're going to go from a deep squat that we're going to hold for five seconds, come back into that happy place that you just did here for five seconds. So we really try to engage the muscle to a certain amount of time and maintain that position and then releasing it. Let me show you first without the vibration. So I'm sitting into the imaginary chair that is behind here and hold for five seconds. You can definitely push on your heel here because you're not going to feel the vibration to the head. When you come back after the five seconds, keep a soft knee, load the ball of the foot and hold for five seconds. Are we ready? Let's start the vibration. 30 seconds. Down. Here we go. Five, four, three, two, one, back to the happy place, five, four, three, two, one, load, sit into the imaginary chair, five, four, three, two, one, back and up, five, four, three, two, one, one more, down into the chair, five, four, three, two, one, and coming back. Now my vibration stop. I'm at the end of those 30 seconds. Woo! Start feeling it? Yes, me too. Now the third superset is to do a pulse. The purpose of the pulse is to keep the tension on the muscle without ever releasing that tension. So you're working really on that contractile endurance. Let me show you. Imagine that chair behind you and I'm going to tap my little tailbone on that chair without never releasing. It's about an inch up, an inch down, right? Are you ready? 30 seconds on my vibration. Here we go. You can keep the heel loaded with your body weight on that one. And you can hold or not. You do that with support or not. You know your level of, 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 um, uh, of fitness, right? You know your level. So just adapt. Now you can really feel that tension building up in the muscle from loading that energy and never releasing. Come on, keep it up. You got about 10 more seconds here. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Woo! Gosh, I'm happy that vibration stopped. All right. This is our last set, the fourth set, which is going to be explosive. We want to tap into every fiber in the muscle. What does that mean? 
we're going to count how many dynamic squat you can do within the 30 second and you're going to keep that record somewhere because the next time you're doing that exercise routine you're going to want to beat your own record 30 second and here's how it looks like as fast as we can sitting from the chair to standing up soft knee at the end you're not staying vertical for very long you're going to stay vertical and back drop so two three four right we're going to go fast here so are you ready 30 seconds start your vibration one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen nineteen Oh my God, I lost my count because I'm so focusing on my legs that I'm lost here. All right, and then I count much better in French. Are you ready? Woo! I got about five more seconds here on the timer and relax. Woo! What's happening during that last set is your heart rate went up, right? You can feel that. And then you're really feeling now those muscle that we have superset for those four sets. So, how are you going to progress from this? Two options. You can go for a longer period of time. So, from 30 seconds, I'm going to do 60 seconds each of those exercises. Or, I'm going to start challenging myself on a different vibration. Do it on 35 hertz. Do it on 40 hertz, which is your three first light. And then after, you can venture in a different amplitude. I can do 30 seconds on four light, which is the same speed than one light, which is 30 hertz, but now your machine is moving higher up and down. How does it look like for a push-up? Now that I'm recovering, let's do it for a push-up. I'm gonna start with a kneeling push-up. So you can have a little towel underneath your knee, and we're going to do the same thing, 30 seconds, but we're gonna hold that uh, push-up position, if you want, by lining up the shoulder, the hip, and the knee. So I put my hand far forward, and then look, instead of having my butt over my knee, I'm gonna line up bringing my chest, my, my hip forward. I have a soft elbow. I'm going to look forward and I'm going to start my vibration static for 30 seconds. If you want to close your eyes here, close your eyes. You can do that. Let's start the vibration. Hold it here. If you want to add a little bit of muscle tension, I want you to imagine that you're bringing your hand closer to each other, creating a little bit more muscle tension. Remember, you're in control here. You the one that is bringing more tension on that muscle, okay? Good. I've got about 10 more seconds here. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and relax. Woo. Shake your little arm, shake your little uh, wrist because the next one is static variable. I'm gonna go low close my chest, closer my chest to the, to the platform, and then come back to that first position that I just had right now. Are you ready? All right, so start your vibration, and we're staying low. Five, four, three, two, one. Bring back, but keep a soft elbow. Five, four, three, two, one. Get back low. Five, four, Three, two, one. Woo! Bring it back up. Five, four, three, two, one. Two more. Five, four, three, two, one. Moving up. Five, four, three, two, one. Go back down. Five, four, and my vibration just stopped, so I'm not going to complete that one. Shake your arm, shake your wrist. 
you definitely feel so much more fatigue into the fiber. Now remember, that third set is a little pulse. So you're gonna have to go inch, one inch up, one inch down. We're keeping the tension on the fiber engage here, which is core, upper chest, arm. Are we ready? Start your vibration. Here we go, small move. If you need to take a break, take a break. But that's it, that's the motion. I have my hip aligned with my shoulder and knee and I'm just bouncing, small move. Keep the tension on the muscle. Woo! We've got 10 more seconds here. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and relax. Whew. Shake those arms. You start really feeling it, right? Yeah, your upper body strength is very different than your lower body strength. So for sure. Now remember, how many are you going to be able to do on that fourth superset? How many can you do of push-up in the kneeling position? Start not compromising your form because you're getting tired. Just slow down. So it's not how fast bad I can do, it's how fast good I can do. Do you understand? Let's go. 30 seconds, start your vibration. One, full range of motion. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, and my vibration just stopped. Hey, I'm at 26, I'm pretty happy with my score. Make sure that you're gonna write it down. So, you're gonna be able to apply that to other motion like a tricep dip, maybe a lunge, like a static lunge, one foot on the ground, one foot on the floor. I will show you that in a different video that will engage triceps and your split squats.